Hey everybody, I'm Nasty Mold, and today we're going to be doing the third quest in the Season of Flight. Last time we repaired the boat that the Manta now carries. And this time, let's see. Hey, Flight Guide. Chimes have been mysteriously going missing lately. Oh no. Poor Chime Smith. Oh no! Poor Chime Smith! Man, those are strong birds. Oh. We must help. Bird hunting. I shall sit. Thank you. Alright, so this one is up top. And let's see what we have to do. Oh, they're just floating. Get back the chimes that the birds have carried away. No bird hunting today, which is probably for the best. <laughs> um, I guess we'll get these ones first. Um, if I remember, these are scattered everywhere, including in the actual um, wind path area, so... It's a, it's a fair bit of flying. Kind of like the rally spirit. Oh. Ah! I didn't mean to go in there. Okay. Uh, one thing I remember that was annoying was flying into these bottom parts, but I think they fixed it so it's a little easier. So we have some down here. Whoa! Oh. Flying through those is very satisfying, though. Um, I don't think we'll go that way first. We'll get all the stuff in the actual village area. Oh, we have another one below. Man, the music for this quest is really nice. Uh, okay, yeah, we have one over here. We have two over here. I think that might be it for the village. Don't go into the ground. What are you doing? Never mind, we're safe. Uh, oh, we have one more down here. So it's in every single one of these little tunnels underneath. Well, I think we did that pretty efficiently. And uh, now time for the wind path area. I don't think there's anything else over here. Yeah. Okay. There's like two over here. Oh no, there's a lot. Alright. I know I've said it before, but I really like how they're doing this season's quests. I find them really fun. They're the best parts of the assembly quest without all of the players that need to be there. And it's fun to see the changes with every quest. It's nice when the area changes more, like the uh, enchantment area. That was one of my favorites for these new quests. Okay. Oh man, this is really in here, huh? I'm gonna go around here and then around there. I guess we missed one at the front. Get over here. They're kind of hard to see in the clouds. It'd be better if they were maybe a different color, like that orange or purple, but I know that's meant for traveling spirits. So I guess it makes sense.
Okay, and that's it. Should we be lazy? Yeah, we'll be lazy. We were right there, but might as well. Hello, flight guide. I have your stray chimes. You fulfill the wish of this ancestor spirit. Chime Smith! Good to see you happy again. Yeah! So pretty. Alright, so we summon some mantas, it looks like. Oh, you know what? They're gonna go bust down that wall. Let us through! I wonder if this is how the mantas make their way through the realms as well. It makes sense. Boom! Nice. Alright, so now we have access to, I believe, the entire wind path. It's so big. Oh my god. Ay ay ay. Alright, we'll get your heart. Thank you very much, flight guide. And uh, let's check out all the new wind path stuff. So at the moment, the wind paths are pretty hard to navigate just because they're so deep and there's no fast way to really go through it, but eventually that'll be remedied, don't worry. I know for the moment it's a lot of flapping. Look how cool they look. I love the blue colors, the light shining through. It's so well done, and like the, uh, the cloud shapes are really unique. So we're just going to see on the right side where all the new stuff is. Go around that way. Because later on in the wind paths we will be using the right side, so we might as well get used to it now. We have this. This is new. Little waterfalls. Very cute. Where do you think this will lead us to? That's right, it brought us to the Sanctuary Islands, which is really nice because this is one of the farthest places to go in the game. Um, it does bring us up to the very, very top where that big island is for our final quest in this area. You can see it up there. But let's go back through and we'll see the other areas. We're gonna keep right still, so we don't get lost. Oh, I spotted some candle cakes. Yeah! So around each of these exits, there's like a small cluster of candles, but there's also some candle cakes. Um, I don't recall if this is the only one. I'll, I'll have to uh, double check. Now over here, we have another exit. It's quite purple. I think we all know where this is going to bring us, but let's go anyways. Ooh. It brings us to the storybook lands of the Starlight Desert where the Little Prince season took place. So pretty. I don't come here enough. There's not enough wax here to like really go out of my way back in and to our final new spot again we're going to keep going right and ugh, you can probably guess where this one is it looks disgusting Look at all that dark matter coming out. 
Ay, 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 ay. Ew. This one is probably one of the best shortcuts, just because this is a really annoying place to get to with the cutscene and everything. But this brings us to the Forgotten Ark. I wonder if as more places will be unlocked, if they'll add more wind path shortcuts? Oh, it looks so creepy right now because it's not updated. Ooh, it's all green. Ugh! Gross. Icky arc. So now we've unlocked every single shortcut in the wind paths, which is pretty exciting. Um, a lot more interesting candle runs might happen. I'd like to see what people have ideas for for unique new candle runs to get the most out of your candles, but for now, this is it. It's a little slow to go through here, but uh, that will change. The wind paths, all updated. So nice. That is it for the third quest in the Season of Flight. I really enjoyed it. I hope you guys did too. Thanks so much as always for watching. Hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye!